In this video, I'm going to share a story about my battle with alcohol and how when I quit drinking, it actually made my life a lot worse. So I used to drink a lot of alcohol. I sadly invested the majority of my 20s into the party scene. And of course, like most things not taken in moderation, alcohol created a huge imbalance in my life. I ran into problems with addiction, depression, trouble with the law. I ruined a lot of relationships and friendships. I lost a lot of money, time, memories, and gained nothing but regrets. But thankfully, I possessed the power to be able to quit. In the last 13 years, I've quit drinking on multiple occasions for various stretches of time, ranging from a month all the way to two years. And for the most part, life without alcohol is so much better than with it. I save my money, I remember everything, I feel a whole lot less shame, I feel more pride, I have more control over my emotions, I focus on my future rather than instant gratification, all of this and more. But what no one talks about is after I quit drinking, I physically felt horrible. And that's a question I wanna ask you. Have you ever quit drinking and felt worse? Let me know in the comments section. I would really like to know if anybody else has shared this experience with me. Yes, after I quit drinking, I felt horrible. And when I told people about this, they would say shit like, oh, it's just detox. It's just your body going through withdrawal. But no, a normal withdrawal period from alcohol is like two weeks max. And the first two weeks of being sober, I felt amazing. It wasn't until like a month in that I would start feeling like shit. I felt like shit. I looked like shit. I grew these huge bags under my eyes. People always ask me, why do you look so tired all the time? Are you not sleeping well? I looked tired because I was tired. I felt exhausted all the time. I would go to the gym every single day, but I would always feel weak. I developed all these food sensitivities. I had to stop eating gluten, dairy, processed foods, sugar. I even started to get zits and rashes all over my face. I completely changed my ways and consistently ate a very strict, healthy diet and lived an active, healthy lifestyle. Yet, I felt like shit all the time. It was absolutely devastating. And this was a very difficult thing to struggle with considering I didn't struggle with any of this shit when I was drinking. When alcohol was in my life, I ate like shit. I didn't go to the gym, I never exercised. I could smash an entire pizza to myself and feel fine after. I could go to work hungover and have lots of energy to do physical labor. I literally felt healthier with alcohol in my life than I did when I was sober. And of course, knowing this and believing this, many times I just resorted back to drinking. And sure enough, like clockwork, every time I brought alcohol back into my life, I felt fine. I suddenly could eat whatever I wanted to again. My food sensitivities disappeared. I didn't get zits and rashes on my face. I didn't feel exhausted all the time. So you can just imagine how much harder it would be to stay sober when you literally feel worse than when you're drinking. Knowing that all you have to do to feel normal is to have a drink. For the last 13 years, I've wasted so much of my life diving in and out of sobriety for this very reason. For 13 years, I've been on an endless mission to try to figure out what the fuck is wrong with me. Until now. Because about two months ago, I finally discovered the answer. And you are not going to believe what it is. But before I share it, please do me a huge favor and show YouTube that you are enjoying this video. Click the like button, subscribe, and don't forget the bell. Thank you, I really appreciate it. So, currently I have been sober for five months. And this time around, finally, I feel normal again. I'm not tired all the time. I actually have energy every day. I can eat whatever I want, gluten, dairy, sugar. Although I probably shouldn't eat those things. I don't have zits and rashes all over my face. So why did this all happen then? For the past 13 years, what was the solution to all of my constant suffering? 
probiotics. That was the answer this whole time. Everyone always tells you to take your probiotics. That's all I had to do this whole time? Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah. Probiotics solved my chronic health issues, and here's why. Your gut health affects the health of your entire body. A healthy gut contains a balance of good and bad bacteria and yeast, but alcohol can destroy the good bacteria and yeast and allow an overgrowth of the bad bacteria and yeast. However, my drink of choice was beer, and certain beers can actually contribute to a healthy gut. So what I think happened is me drinking so much beer created some sort of balanced gut bacterial ecosystem that worked for my body while I was frequently consuming beer. But then as soon as I stopped consuming beer, my whole ecosystem went out of whack and I developed an overgrowth of bad bacteria and yeast, which explains why I developed food sensitivities. It explains why I was tired all the time. It explains why I got weird skin reactions on my face. And it explains why by taking probiotics, I was able to restore the balance in my gut and start feeling normal again. And while I am extremely happy that I'm finally feeling normal again, I'm kind of pissed off because I endured so much fucking pain and suffering for years. I spent years trying to figure out what the hell was wrong with me. I thought there was something seriously wrong with my health. I had some sort of disease. I thought I was dying. And the whole time, the solution was, oh, just take a couple probiotic pills in the morning. So the bottom line is in life, sometimes you unnecessarily suffer so much. And more often than not, the solution is actually really simple. If you are in any way struggling like I was, hopefully your solution is just as simple as mine. Just don't give up. And hopefully you don't have to waste 13 years of your frickin' life like I did.